Wasn't it true that someone once said, a very wise man said, the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. It begins with that first step. You got to put that first step forward. I remember growing up, how many here remembers uh, the old Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer cartoons growing up? Remember the old, uh, the old winter warlock out there and how he couldn't get around and they sang that addictive song and I will not sing it to you tonight because you'll go home and you'll, you'll curse my name. But the song is, you know, you got to put one foot in step with the other and soon you'll be walking out the door. And that seems so trivial, it seems so elementary, it seems so childish, but it is so true that when people begin to get to a certain age, they'll start to settle in, they'll start to turn in the towel, they start to, the, the day of hard work and blood, sweat, and tears, and the day of grit is over. And uh, they mentally retire, hang up their hat as it were, and they settle into the worst thing that you can settle into in life, and that is being comfortable. And just, I don't need any more, and I don't need to do any more. And guys, listen, the masses are this way. But that's not you and I. And that's not future leaders. And that's not entrepreneurs. And that's not people that heal diseases. And that's not people that build robotic prosthesis. And that's not people that rise through the ranks of politics to change their city. And that's not people that volunteer at food shelters and work at the Red Cross and go to other countries and, and give, of their, give of their goods. Physicians that take their vacations every year to go in other countries and to fix cleft palates and cleft lips and go and break. Listen, that tells me right now that, that money isn't enough. When wealthy people that drive wonderful cars and live in mansions, when there is a drive in them to go somewhere else, to put themselves in harm's way, that tells me that achieving a bunch of stuff things, items, tangible stuff must not be enough. And that there is, and I'll say this, and uh, it's a brave statement, but there is a level of achievement that outranks possessions. And many people never know that, and they spend their entire life focusing on the possessions. The problem with having a possession and a result focused life or business or job or whatever it is you do is that once you get the results you become unhappy that's the problem so life isn't just about the destination it's about the journey along the way it's not just about what i can collect on the way it's about how am i living as i get there is my family intact when i get there are my friendships intact when i get there